Hey everybody, this is Dan Strong with Excel VBA is fun. Today I have a question from James, and he said this is a task I've spent a whole day looping through, or looking through forums. I can't find out how to do it. I want to have a shape like a box or something, and when I move my mouse over it, I'd like it to run a macro. So, and it could just be a message box that says "Have a great day." Any help would be appreciated. So James, we absolutely can do that. Um, it's not the way you think perhaps when you go to insert and you go to shapes and let's just use one of these bubble ones for example just make a big giant button so you think you know you want you want it to be when you move your mouse not when you click but when you move your mouse where it'll uh, trigger a macro so the problem with that is a shape is one of those things where you have to assign the macro kind of like the developer insert form controls like one of these form control buttons where you can't really have a, 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 a there's only a, a macro assigned to clicking on the button. There's not like different events like when you have ActiveX controls, where you can have events such as mouse move is what you're thinking of. But there is a workaround that comes to mind that we could try. Um, if you go to Insert on the Developer tab and go to ActiveX controls, and let's just use maybe a label because a label we can make transparent. So let's make a giant label about the size and dimensions of that. And you're thinking, well, that kind of defeats the purpose because it covers it up. Well, let's right click and go to properties. First of all, let's take away the thing that says label one on the caption here so that at least that will be blank. Now the next thing is you want to make it, uh, the back style is FM back style opaque or opaque. So if you double click or, or select, we want to double click and select transparent. So here's our label. It's just transparent, okay? So let's put it back. Oops, Control Z, Control Z. So now it's uh, transparent, the label. And and this is what it would look like if you had words on it. Put the caption. Let's just show you. Anyway, so we're going to take no caption, and it's a blank label. People will not even know that there's a label over your box here, but there is. And guess what? Labels just so happen to have the ability to double click on the label and have a click event or a double click event or whatever, including mouse move. So if you go to a mouse move event, which means when somebody hovers the mouse over it, let's just put a message box. I think you said have a great day, so let's do that. Have a great day! Exclamation point. End quote. And so now when we do a mouse move, I'm going to move my mouse. Oops, I'm in design mode. Now when I move my mouse over it, it says ding. It says Has a great, have a great day. I think that's what you're wanting, James. So this workbook will be available uh, for download instantly. Just go to my Dropbox link. Um, and that is in the video description. Not Hovier. Hover over the blue shape secretly. Oh my gosh, secretly. A an invisible a transparent label over it. Okay. So there's your instructions. Oops, I <laughs> triggered it again. Okay, so anyway, that's how you do that. Thanks for watching, and as always, God bless.